Okay, find the range of possible values of k so that this has at least one real solution. So first of all, this is the quadratic in e raised to x. Yeah. So you get this on this side. You get your. Well, you get both e is on one side. Correct. You get a quadratic. So let you can assume. Hmm. Let e raised to x be equal to y. Mm -hmm. So what does this become? y square minus 3y plus ln k is equal to 0. Uh, minus 3y, yeah. yeah, correct. So a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 3, c is equal to ln k. Now when will it have real solution? b square minus 4ac should be greater than or equal to 0. Yeah, because, so can I just recap, so basically, this is a So b square, Negative 3 to the whole square. Minus 4ac is greater than or equal to 0. Correct? So 9 minus 4 ln k is greater than or equal to 0. So 9 is greater than or equal to 4 ln k. Correct? So 9 upon 4. So k is less than or equal to e raised to 9 upon 4. See how do you do that? How do you get that? I just solve the inequality. Now they want range of values. Now they've given you. Now can a log of a negative number exist? It's, it's your ln k. Yeah. It's your ln k. So they're saying find a range of possible values. Hmm. So k is less than this, and so so your zero is less than k is less than equal to e raised to nine by four. Is that the range of values? Very important sum, I think so. Yeah?